What happens when you take the world's slimmest phone and make it even thinner? Well, you get the Geony e Life S5.1. It's me, Shimon, from right now, and today we're gonna unbox this beast. So, without any further ado, let's get started. Alright, so here's the box itself. So we have the eLife S5.1 on the front. On the back we have some technical specifications which we will run down later. So first, let's just rip open the box, shall we? So using my trusty unboxing knife, which is very conventional. Very, very conventional. Okay, a small precise cut and you're done. Just lift the box slightly and move. So you're greeted by uh, a cover and wow. So it's a cover which you find on the S5.5 itself. So it's a white cover, it's a flip cover and you have the adhesive one. So it has cutouts for the camera and for the speaker. So it's really cool. So this can bend so it can act as a stand too. So we will come back to that later. Here's the phone itself. My, my, that is really slim. Wow, that seems so light, seriously light. Wow, that's amazing. So let's keep it aside before I drool over it. Okay, so once we dig deeper into the box, let's lift it up. You are greeted by the power plug, or the power adapter, you can say. It's a normal adapter. Let's keep it aside. Let's open this compartment. Okay, I went for that one. So you have your USB cable, the standard USB cable, let's get inside, and the second compartment you have the earphones I presume, yep, and I'm not disappointed, it's the earphones, and these are in-ear type ones, it's a big plus, in-ear types are much more superior than the normal flat, flat ones, yeah, what do you call, what do you call them, so, th those are not good, these are good, so that's cool, let's keep it aside, and the last component in the box. Let's keep everything aside. Okay, so once you open this, wow, wow, dude, you're outdoing yourself. So you've got screen guards, like one, two, three, four of them. Wait, so one each, I mean two each for front and back. Each one has a microfiber cloth. Wow, <laughs> that is amazing. Then you have a silicon cover. That's really handy, really handy. Then you have an OTG cable. Wow! You're giving all of this in this package? That is really awesome. Then you have the SIM ejector tool. And your quick start user guide. Some more mumble jumble. Let's keep it inside. And let's have a look at the beauty. Itself. It is 5.1 millimeters thin, like, see how thin it is. So it is 5.15 to be precise. So it's got DDS sound, it has an 8 megapixel camera on the back, 5 megapixel on the front, and the front facing camera is 88 degrees wide. It is Corning Gorilla Glass 3 on the front, so it's 4.8 AMOLED display, 4.8 inch AMOLED display. It is powered by an octa-core 1.7 GHz processor and its battery capacity is 2050 mAh. So I guess it will last long. Wow, it really looks good. It's really sexy. Alright, so let's take a take a front covering. Oh, we can take it off. Wow, that is amazing. So there's one covering at the back itself. Let's peel that off too. Okay, so now we have the bare bone phone itself, so let's boot it up. I hope it has juice left. Yeah, so it says Juni powered by Android. That's new. So, talking about the device, it feels really good in hand. Really good. So, it's not your average curved phone, just curved from the back. No, it's really thin. So, there will the boot animation. So. Oh, here you have the home button, you have the back button, and you have the menu button or option button, as they call it. So, the top you have uh, some sensors, the earpiece, the front facing camera. On the left, you have the power button, 
the volume rocker. On the top you have the antenna band and on the right you have the SIM slot. Mind you, um, this doesn't have expandable storage, it just has uh, internal memory of 16 GB. Alright, so you have the speaker over here, the loudspeaker, and the secondary mic over here, 8 megapixel shooter, LED flash, and that's it. So at the bottom you have 3.5 mm jack for audio, so you have the primary mic and you have the micro USB port. That's it guys, that was a quick unboxing of the GME e S5.1. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. And if you have any questions in mind, please don't hesitate to leave a comment down below. And as always, stay subscribed for more tech videos like this. And I've got some sweet stuff coming up soon, so subscribe. I'll meet you in the next one. Bye-bye.